What's up, Pokemon fans? I'm Professor K for the Pokemon Evolutionaries, and today I am opening up a box that my good friend Majin Cobra sent to us. You guys know him before as Master Cobra, and he has done a lot for me and this channel in general. Uh, he is the top donator we have on Twitch, and he has sent us so much incredible stuff. I keep telling him not to. We become really, really, really good friends and he still does it anyway. So I have no idea what all is inside of this box. I just know that this box is way bigger than the one I was expecting. He did tell me that he was sending me uh, a specific Dragon Ball Super related item and also the cards that I bought from him like six months ago that he forgot to mail for like the longest time. That's all that's supposed to be in here. I have no idea what else is. So I'm gonna open up this box here in front of me. I know you guys can't really see anything, but I'm also limited for space. So we got a bunch of bags for packaging reasons. So that helps. Oh, this can't be good. This cannot be good. There's a binder in here, guys. Oh man, this can't be good. It feels heavy. All right. This also can't be good because he loves Charizard. And I know that he keeps his Charizard collection in a Charizard binder. Oh man, this can't be good. Oh man. All right, so here's what I was actually expecting, which is this Future Trunks pop. Uh, the reason why he got me this was because Lucas actually ripped the portion of the sealed box off here, so I had to just open it up. And I've been collecting Dragon Ball uh, Super, Dragon Ball GT, Dragon Ball, all that good stuff, uh, popped. So I have a whole bunch of them, actually. I can't show them because my light's blocking them. But right now, this is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, uh, 15. This is my 16th one. And yeah, he sent it. I knew he was going to send that one. So that was expected. So thank you for that, Cobra. And the rest of the box, uh, we got this, another box. This has got the cosplay Pikachus on it. No clue what that could possibly be. And a tin full of what seems to be sleeves and either cards or code cards or something up at the top. The rest of the box is filled with forbidden light packs, but these have all been opened, so I'm guessing this was packaging material as well. So that is what is everything inside of the box. Now it's time to see what in the world Cobra has sent to us this time. Mr. Above and Beyond himself. Let's find out. So we're gonna start by opening up this Pokemon card game box with the cosplay Pikachus on them, which I like this box quite a bit. There's the Charizard X. Oh, they're both Charizard X on either side. Let's open it up. All right, oh, that's, okay, this is cool. Yo, check it out. <laughs> we got some Dragon Ball figures here. Oh, this is so cool. Wow. I didn't even know that he had any kind of Goku figures like this. This is so cool. It's even got its own little stand, just like the Pokemon ones. Where did this even come from? This is a Ban Presto figure. Wow. Okay. Uh, and we got Super Saiyan Blue as well. Oh, man. Oh, no. This one broke off of its stand in the box. Oh, that feels bad. But that's okay, because the figure's still awesome. Oh, and it can still stand. Okay, cool. So, yeah. You can actually... I can still make it work, like, up in the air, like this. Still works, even though it broke. I can put him way up there. Or I can take this out and set him on the stand itself because there are holes in his feet. Oh, maybe not. This isn't the right stand for it. Ah, oh, it feels bad. But we can still put him like that, so that's fine. Nice. Put him like that. And like that. All right, put it back together. There we go. This is so cool. I'll put it with my other Goku figure I have up there as well. All right. There's that. And he fell over. Oh, well, can't be helped. All right, we got a bunch of code cards. Oh, there's another one. What? Oh, we got a regular Goku, too. This is cool. Is there another stand for him in here? I think I totally missed it if there was. Ah, there it is. Okay, so this... The stands got switched. Okay, now I see. All right, this is the right stand for Goku. Because this one's much closer together. Yeah, that's it. All right, so this is the right stand. He stands on his own two feet there. Very cool. And then this one stands on this one. Okay, so you can have him way up like that or have him just mounted there like that. Very nice. All right, now we got code cards. What in the world code cards? I saw one in here already that I'm like, this is sweet. Yeah, this one, that's gonna be fun. 
Uh, we got Plasma Blast, Plasma Storm, Plasma Freeze, a whole bunch of code cards. I didn't even know he had cards from this set. All right, so we've got stuff from Forbidden Lights. We got stuff from uh, Ultra Prism, Burning Shadows. We've got some Shining Legends, I believe, in here. Uh, Plasma Freeze, Plasma Blast, Plasma Storm. Oh, man. We're going to have a good couple of streams with those for sure. And the cards that I bought are in here as well. Okay, cool. Um, more code cards. Put those over there. Matter of fact, I'm going to give you guys one of the Forbidden Light code cards right here, right now. There you go. Hopefully you get something cool out of that. All right. So what I purchased from him was this stack of cards, and I don't even remember how long ago it was. I forgot what I've even bought, but I do know that the uh, Bagon was part of it. So I think it was a bunch of older stuff, mostly. If I can get the tape to break loose, I probably should have put the scissors there. There we go. All right. So we got this Blastoise. Oh, wow. This is a Heart Gold Soul Silver Unleashed Stamped Blastoise. I didn't get this one. This must be an extra. That's awesome. I wonder where this actually came from. Is it like a pre-release card? Never seen that before. I have to look into that one for sure. All right, code, car, regular cards here we've got. We got a shiny bag on, which is fitting, of course, you know, since I lost mine in game. <sighs> Never lived that one down. Erica's Clefable. This is a first edition holo from Jim Heroes, I believe, or Jim Challenge. I can never tell. I forget which, which circle is which. One's dark and or one's black, one's white. We got a Chansey from base set two. A Misty Cedra First Edition Hollow, a Blaine's Moltres, Vaporeon, Polyrath, First Edition Snorlax, we got an Electrode, a Dark Gyarados, and a Flareon. So these are all the older Hollows that I bought from him. Like I said, I think it was like four or five, maybe even six months ago. I don't know. We lost track of time, but I knew I would get him in the end, so no worries there. Very, very cool. Thank you for sending these finally, man. Now. Uh, oh, no, we got a 10 first before we get into the other stuff. In here, these are all cards. Okay. What is all this? Sleeves? Oh, no, there's more cards. What the heck is this? More cards in penny sleeves. And then a whole bunch of regular sleeves, too. So there's a pack full of green sleeves. Uh, it's just a bunch of random loose sleeves. This is the one from the, uh, the box itself from earlier. With the Pikachu. There's another card. That's a Max. There's Max Elixirs in here. And Zoroarks. What the? All right. So we got Penny Sleeves. Some Black Sleeves. Oh, these are all Charizard Sleeves here. There's some Charizard Sleeves. And more Charizard Sleeves. Wow, there's a whole bunch of these things. Wow. Pikachu. Mega Charizard X as well. So I'll put these in with the rest of our sleeves. Ah, put that back there. All right, now, as I said, these two are these these four cards already got caught up in that stack. A couple of Max Elixirs and a couple of Zoroarks. What do we have here? All right, we got some Reverse Hollow Rares by the looks of it. All right, we got Victini, Aurorus, Lilligant, Oracorio, Victory Bell, Sogaleo, Heliolisk, Verizian, Regirock, Gyarados, Rayquaza, Vanillix, Schmarshing, Probopass, Serena, Banette, Machamp, Rayquaza, Honchkrow, Sharpedo, Swellow, Wishcash, uh, Lolan Sandslash, Delmes, Blissey, Turtonator, Mimikyu, Hoopa, Electros, Turtonator, Araquanid, Scolipede, Toxicroak, Alola Marowak, Lucario, Gyarados, Lycanroc, Golduck, Togekiss, Glissopod, uh, Talonflame, Bruxish, Electivire, Mud Mudsdale, Heracross, Lycanroc, Gyarados, Pangoro, Toxicroak, Pheromosa, that's actually one of the ones that I needed a while back. Don't need more, though. Barbarical, Infernape, we got Pyroar, Florges, Abomasnow, and Gudra. All reverse hollow rares. Jeez. How many packs have you been opening, dude? <laughs> last time, last time uh, he sent something, he said he was done with Pokemon, but then he started opening some more stuff, and I guess he opened up a lot more than I thought. All right, we got some energy here. Uh, oh, hollow energy, fairy. We got a couple of Hoopa hollows. Infernape, Aurorus, Diantha, Pyroar, Gudra, Pheromosa, we got Delphox, Weavile, Luxray, Porygon Z, Dust Noir, Darkrai, Palisand, Porygon Z, Dust Noir again. We got some Shining Legend stuff Rayquaza, Manaphy, Marshadow, Latios, Keldeo, uh, Raikou, Absol, Minior, Politoed, 
There's a X and Y promo Yveltal, Gigalith, Dragonite, Comfe, Blissey, Mimikyu, Victini, Drampo, another Mimikyu, Mudsdale, uh, Chandelure, Empoleon, Dust Noir, Lycanroc. Got a whole bunch more. A lot of these are repeating. We got one from Steam Siege there with Bisharp, Vicavolt, Milotic. Wow. That's a lot of hollows too. Jeez. Oh, man. I'm scared to know what is in the rest of these binders. I really am. Because I have no clue what could be in this one. I feel like I know what's in here, and I, I, I'm almost scared to look, because if it's what I think it is, you're going to be in trouble if it is what I think it is, Cobra. I'm telling you that right now. I don't like the looks of this. But we're going to save that one for last. All right, so we got this binder here now. I recommended this binder to him because, as you can see up here... Ah, upside down, but this is an Ultimate Guard binder. I remember when I told him that that was the kind of binder he needed to get, because this thing is really, really good. So we got the Zipfolio Xeno skin, and now I have it. And I don't know why, Cobra. Let's see what we have here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is going to be... Ah, he's in trouble. We got a Zygarde here. This is the one that they're giving away at GameStop when you purchase a certain amount of Pokemon TCG product. Uh, I don't have this card yet. So, thank you for getting this for me, man. I appreciate it. Um, I haven't been to GameStop in quite a while, so... I wouldn't have gotten this card otherwise. So, that's awesome. This, though. Alright, I'm gonna adjust the camera so you guys can see this a little bit better. But this is gonna be... This is gonna be crazy, I can tell already. Alright, so here is the start of the binder. We got a couple of Volcanian EXs up there. We got the Toys R Us Charmander. Couple of Charizard GXs, so that's not in the Charizard binder. That might actually not be such a bad sign then. Shining Jirachi, you got Raichu GX, Shining Genesect, and Tapu Bulu GX. What the? Okay, I didn't think he was actually gonna do it. I was warned about this card, but I didn't think he was gonna do it. That is a mysterious treasure, secret rare. <sighs> Cobra. We got Lycanroc GX Full Art, Hoopa EX, Palkia GX. We got Gyarados EX. That's a secret rare right there. A super boost energy. A rainbow rare Yveltal GX. And the Ganadel GX full art. Ultra Recon Squad full art. Oh, man. On this side, we've got Mewtwo GX, Dialga. We got Alolan Golem, Metagross, Wishy Washy GX full art, Altaria EX, Tapu Fini GXs, and a Coco GX. Uh, what? Oh, my God. What the? Uh, what, what are you doing, Cobra? <laughs> Shining Ho Oh up here. This comes with the Elite Trainer Box for Shining Legends. That is a Rainbow Rare Gyarados. There, get it up there a little bit closer. Rainbow Rare Gyarados GX, Dialga. Look at these secret rares Switch, Random Receiver, and Enhanced Hammer. This is from Plasma Storm. I don't even know if. I don't even know if that card is even like. Pullable anymore because black and white stuff is so hard to find now. Another secret rare Gyarados, but this Ultra Necrozma, this card is so hard to pull. I mean, yeah, he knows that we needed two more for decks, but ah, Arceus Prism Star, uh, Deancey, Beast Energy, and Beast Ring up here. Oh, this is cool. Uh, Jolteon EX, Shaman EX, we got Full Art Kyogre EX. We got Articuno, this is from the Generations, uh, Altaria EX, Scizor EX Full Art, Mega Rayquaza EX Full Art, one of the most beautiful Full Art G uh, EX cards of that entire era, Manaphy EX Full Art, nothing on that page, okay, got some Hoopas here, so we got four more Hoopa, nothing on that page, okay, alright, empty, 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 oh, Wow, okay. This is a lot of primes. So we got Don Fan Prime. I'm just going to say the Pokemon's name because these are a lot of primes. We got Don Fan, Ampharos Magnezone, another Ampharos, Meganium, Typhlosion, Crobat, Blissey, and Lantern. Mew Prime. That's cool. I don't know if I've ever even had that card before. Celebi, Gengar, Yanmega. We got Machamp, and Alf Lithograph. I don't think I've seen this one before. All right, so. Return any stadium card in play to the player's hand. So that's a secret rare. I've never seen that one. The only one I have, I think, is the brown one. 
And then down here we've got some uh, hollows. We got Typhlosion, Fur Alligator, and Meganium. Oh wow. All right. So there's a Zekrom, a Kyo another Kyogre, Rayquaza, and Groudon EX Full Arts. What the heck? A full set of Ash's Pikachu promos. Ah, uh, these are all the ones that you could pull out of the GameStop. This is this, this the movie one isn't here, but all the ones you could pull from the packs from GameStop and Target when they were doing that promotion. They're all here's number 109, 10, 11, 12, 13, and 114. We got some uh, pre-release promos with Drampa, Crabominable, Regirock, a Hollow promo Mewtwo, and a Misty Seedra pre-release card. That's really cool. Uh, let's see, we got a Rockruff promo, Zygarde, Litten, Togedemaru, Cosmog, and Mea Alola Meowth, uh, Rayquaza, Mewtwo, Giratina. Some older stuff here. We got Victini, Kiram, Hitmonchan, and Hitmonlee. The Hollow Chimchar, Minin, and Plusle, and a Pikachu promo. Oh, uh, his Lugia collection. No! Oh, man. Lugia and Charizard are two of his favorite Pokemon. That's a reverse Hollow Lugia from Fates Collide. Lugia Break, a Shining Lugia promo. That was from the box. A Japanese Lugia EX, regular Lugia EX. Uh, this is the one from Ancient Origins, and the Lugia EX promo as well, the Plasma one. Uh, the set one, Plasma Storm Lugia EX, and another one from Legendary Treasures. So uh, Plasma Storm, the promo, and the Legendary Treasures, as well as a Japanese Lugia EX. This is the bottom half of Lugia Legend, a full art Lugia EX from uh, Ancient Origins, the full art Lugia EX from Plasma Storm, and the Lugia from Call of Legends. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, Lunala too. That's another one. That's like his top three favorite Pokemon. Lunala GX, Rainbow Rare, and Full Art. Uh, Lunala GX from Sun and Moon, and the promo, and also the uh, Reverse Hollow Rare from Guardians Rising. <sighs> Gym Series Pikachu. Is this real, or is this a sticker? I think this is a sticker. Yeah, this one's a sticker. Okay. So, if it was an actual card, that'd be really cool. But the sticker's cool, too. Nice. Uh, Raichu Prime. Frostlass. Beautifly. A Japanese Monferno. An Arceus. That's from the Arceus subset from Platinum Arceus. There's an Arceus level X from the same set. What the f What are you doing, <laughs> No! Oh my gosh! This Reshiram from Legendary Treasures. This gold card. This is so hard to find now. Oh my gosh. I'm going to have to get this one graded. Dude. This is like a $44 card right now. I'm going to have a long talk with you, Cobra. We're going to have to talk about this. We've got an Alakazam EX Secret Rare. A Raikou EX. Oh, wow. This is really cool. I don't think I've ever seen this card before. Wow. Very, very nice. As a matter of fact, I don't actually know where this is from. It's from the E-Series era. The late E-Series era of 2004. I'm not sure what that set symbol is, though. I don't recognize it. I'll have to look that up. I'm sure you guys will probably realize it in the comment section, but I'll look it up later. Uh, we got the bottom half of Palkia and Dialga Legend. We got a reverse hollow, or we got a hollow darkness energy from Holland Phantoms. Uh, again, another darkness energy. A Japanese Absol. We've got Relicanth, which should be a reverse hollow based off of the Holland Phantoms logo, just like this. A Licky Licky. We got Raikou promo. Is that a shadowless Alakazam? Is this Shadowless? I think it is. It's got some damage to it, but I don't think I've ever had a Shadowless Alakazam in my life. Yeah, it's got it's got some damage to it, but this is definitely Shadowless. That's so cool. Card number one of the original base set. Wow. I didn't even know you had this. That is awesome, man. Oh, all right. We got a Lapras from Fossil. Another Raikou down here. Uh, we got Sceptile. An Absol Reverse, 
some Rayquazas. We've got a, uh, a couple of Delta species, few Delta species actually. We got Water, Fire, and Lightning. So all of these are, or these two are from the same set, which uh, this one I don't remember. I think this is Hidden Legends, perhaps. I think it's Hidden Legends. The other two are from Holland Phantoms, though. All right, there's nothing on that page. Oh, we got some stickers of some friends here and a business card as well. So Pokemon and Wife, Queen City Gaming, and PokeSoup, all really good friends of mine as well. He got stickers from those two, and of course, you guys have seen the Queen City business card before on the Mafuba Jar, especially because he sponsors our channel there. And here we've got the Pikachu, uh, the Pokemon in the movie I Choose You, which is the front card on the, uh, the the packs that come from Target and GameStop during that promotion. There's a Smoochum, which is just a common, down there. Uh, this looks like a card signed by Johnny and a Drizzy. Nice. That's pretty cool. But dude, Cobra, I don't know why you sent me your entire binder. What the heck, man? <sighs> no wonder you wanted me to wait to open up this box. We're going to have to talk about this. We got some talking to do, friend. All right. I can't hide from this any longer. I feel like I know what this is. And if it is what I think it is, that terrifies me even more. All right, this is a smaller binder, so we're gonna adjust the camera again. Bring it down so that the glare is minimized. All right, here we go. I have a feeling that this is his Charizard collection, guys. I, I think it is. <sighs> yep, I think I'm right. All right, so first we have the Hollow Charmander from Burning Shadows that comes inside of the Charizard GX collection box. This is a secret rare Charmander, I believe, Rising Rivals? No. No, that's not Rising Rivals, is it? Oh, man, I'm so bad with the set symbols of that era. But, yeah, this is a secret rare for sure. Reverse Hollow Charmander from Evolutions. Reverse Hollow Charmander from Burning Shadows. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, there's Charizards. There's definitely Charizards. Oh, boy. All right, so this one from Generations up here. Uh, we've got Supreme Victors up there, Charizard G. Reverse Charizard from Evolutions. Uh, Charizard EXs, we've got from Evolutions, Flashfire, Generations, and the promo Charizard EX. How far is this gonna go? Uh, all right, this is the full art promo from the Charizard EX collection box from Generations. Uh, Mega Charizard EX from Flashfire. This is another Mega Charizard, this one is that's the secret rare! Number 107. Oh my gosh. Mega Charizard EX from Evolutions. There's the full art from Flashfire. Uh, this one. Man, you're crazy. Uh, Generations Mega Charizard EX. Charizard G Level X. This is the promo from Diamond and Pearl era. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm terrified. What else even is there? Oh, oh no, no, no. Why, Cobra? No. Okay, this is a secret rare glue rock, which is ah, uh, that's 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 from the same set the Charmander comes in. But this one, yeah, that's crazy. I've never even seen one of these in real life. What the heck? This is a German Charizard up here. This one, Expedition. Is this in his other sleeve? Okay, it better be. I was gonna say, Cobra. I know you better than that. This is from Expedition. This is a hollow Charizard from Expedition. I I don't even know. Gosh, that is in much better shape than I thought it would be. <sighs> Dude, what are you doing? <laughs> um, Charizard EX from Evolutions. We got the Shattered Foil from Platinum Arceus up there. Uh, another one, this is the hollow version, Charizard from Boundaries Crossed, and also the GX from Burning Shadows. Oh my gosh. What? These are the secret rares from Plasma Storm. Japanese and English? Wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Is this the one I think it is? This is the one he bought from me! He bought this card from me like, I don't know, six months to a year ago. What the heck, man? <laughs> I recognize it because it had a crease up here, a little tiny crease. This is the same card. 
Okay. All right. I I I, I see you, Cobra. I see you. <sighs> we got our first Hollow Charizard up here. Char Mega Charizard EX again from Generations. This is a Charizard EX promo XY number 17. Another Charmander from Toys R Us. The Hollow Charizard from Evolutions. A Charizard EX there from Generations. I can't believe that I have this back after you bought it from me. Oh my gosh. A Japanese Secret Rare as well. I didn't even know you had that one. Uh, oh, this is so cool. All right. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. I knew immediately it was fake, but this is like the coolest fake Charizard I've ever seen. This is a fake first edition base set Charizard, but it's a shiny version. That's really neat. It's got hollow all over it, including the inside of the card, but it's also got it on the outside of the card as well. What the heck? That is so neat. I've got another fake Charizard over there that's first edition as well, but not shiny like that. That's cool. Uh, Mega Charizard EX from Evolutions. The Char another Charizard Hollow from Evolutions. A Japanese Charizard EX. The Reverse from Expedition as well. Japanese Charizard from uh, CP6. And then a Hollow Charizard from... Oh, uh, man, what set is that actually? I'm trying to think. Can't even remember now. I know it's the very beginning of the EX era. Is this EX Ruby Sapphire? Maybe this is the one I'm thinking is EX Ruby Sapphire that I messed up earlier. Yeah, I think that's EX Ruby Sapphire. This is... This is his entire Charizard line collection. What are you doing, <laughs> Cobra? Oh, man, I don't know what to do with this guy anymore. I don't know what to do with this guy anymore. I'm, I'm going to have to message him, and we're going to have to talk about this. Cobra. <sighs> Dude. This is too much. Charizard is your favorite Pokemon, dude. This is too much. Ugh. Alright, guys. Well, all we can say is Cobra strikes again. And it's very fitting, considering that, you know, his name's Cobra after all. But still. Dude. Thank you. Uh, yeah, we'll talk about this. Sure. <laughs> Alright, guys. Well, that is gonna do it for today's video. Uh... Yeah, thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And, uh, yeah. Follow the Twitch streams, guys, because Cobra's there quite a bit. You guys can yell at him, too. Someone else needs to do it besides me. I'm telling you. So, we stream on Tuesdays and Fridays. Uh, Tuesdays from 8 p.m. to 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And Fridays from uh, 8 p or 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Cobra's usually there towards the end of one or both of those streams. So, once he joins, just start yelling at him, guys. That's all I can say. All right, well, that's going to do it for today's video. I'm going to go yell at my friend, and we'll see you guys next time. Take care, and have a great day.